Rebecca, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. Southwest of here, near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. still in there? He's dealt with. Good! That looks like a decent horse. You should keep him. You need to hitch him. He's already skittish. with us. Arthur. Yes. It's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler, Mrs. I, he, he was my husband. Hey, 
Somebody's coming. Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Combe O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Uh, Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know the situation were reversed and he'd look for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. You wouldn't leave. Not like that. Well, it wouldn't be the first time. Take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, it seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. It's leading to the river. See, they continue up that way. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkerton. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Try it. 
Tracks go left, down here. Davey got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there, boy. Come on. Hey, look. Over there. You see that? Yeah. John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's, Let's see if he can hear us. Hi, welcome to halfway through the video, and now you're probably wondering why am I looking at your face while I'm watching a gameplay video of a single player game with no commentary. I thought I'd finally be rid of your face and your voice for just one single video. First of all, that hurts me. Second of all, it's for a reason, For if you'll bear with me for just a minute or two, I have a little announcement for all of you watching at home or on the bus or wherever you watch these things, man, I, I, won't, I won't judge you. But yes, yeah, so we have a new YouTube channel. Welcome to the Full Fat Five. Is a new YouTube channel where you can watch me, Squaredy B, along with other friends you might remember, like Royal Rooster and Caltastic, along with plenty other of my esteemed, high-quality content friends on the YouTubes. Me and my friends will be doing multiplayer content of a load of different games for you to enjoy. You want to see some H1Z1 content? The Full Fat Five. You want to see some Battlefront 2 gameplay? The Full Fat Five. You want to see some online Pokemon battles? Well, tough luck, because Pokemon doesn't make games for PlayStation, you should know this by now. It's very unfortunate, but that's the reality we live in. Although, if it did exist, then it would be on... The Full Fat Five. The link to this YouTube channel is in the description. You can also find it in the discussion tab under my very own YouTube channel. It's like the only thing there, so go, go feel free to... Feel free to check it out, man. Right, that's it. I think this ad or whatever the fuck has, like, reached max cringe capacity, so I'm just gonna get going. Please feel free to enjoy the video, if you haven't already thrown up, that is. Goodbye. That's when the camera's supposed to turn off. Turn? Okay, I'll do it myself.
Watch out here. You sure about this? It's coming from this way. Okay. Mierda, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Careful. There's a drop here. Careful here. Stay low under here. Okay. Good now. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up here. Come on. Come on. That sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, can you hear me? Austin, you hear me? John! John! Over here! Down on the ledge! That's John! We're coming! That was there! Down here. Over here. All right. Hot down, Marston. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. <clears throat> Freezing. <clears throat> Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. <clears throat> well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Can't argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Uh, you all right? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Come on. Distract him while you get to the horse. Go! Draw him off. Okay, here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur.
Rangers. I don't feel too good. You'll be fine. It's just like a, a dog bite. Uh, knew a fella. Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. You ain't gonna die. Not yet. some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. Of course. That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. Should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving? Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Yeah. Push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. John! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? Some help. We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Right, here we go. There we go. Ay, <laughs> careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're going to get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. 